we make sure that we grab the bottles that have been labeled. We simply set them in here into the filling machine up onto the shelf. Not many college students get to make their own olive oil, but at Reedley College, they are getting to do just that. Located since 1956 on the historic T.L. Reed Ranch, Reedley College provides agriculture students with unique opportunities for hands-on learning. Reedley College is a, is a real gem located in the heart of the San Joaquin Valley. Uh, the San Joaquin Valley is, is often referred to as the, the breadbasket of the world. And uh, if you're going to teach agriculture and agriculture education, whether it be plant science, animal science, agriculture business, there is no better place to be teaching that than in the heart of production. When I first came to Reedley College, one of the things that I was looking for uh, in the Ag Business Program is I wanted the opportunity for my students to have some hands-on experience with a real-world project. And trying to determine what that project would be, it, it finally came to me that probably the best way to establish that would be to work closely with a plant science instructor and uh, to honestly to hijack a project that he had started prior. Five years ago, we planted a planting of Arbicina olives. The Olive would give us a uh, oil source for our biodiesel labs, anywhere from 20 to 50 gallons that we could use in the classes to convert to biodiesel. Last year, we got the idea, instead of using the oil for biodiesel, that we would start a project where we would try marketing the olive oil. For the students, the project is a chance to participate in every stage of the process. You really put full effort into it, and we go out there into the grove, and we go and handpick the weeds out of there, and it's kind of fun. You're going to go and trim off the bottom leaves. The students have been involved in taking the cuttings and, and propagating the, uh, the olive trees that we've got. They've planted them out into the field. They've installed the irrigation that will provide the water that those plants need to grow. And then as they grow and develop, they are doing the maintaining of those trees and, and trimming the canopy and performing the tillage in between those rows. The project is pretty unique in that you have students from plant soil science backgrounds, but also to animal science, ag business, that are able to participate in the start to finish of a planting and then complete the product where there is a bottle of oil on the table that they had a, a, a part in. With the finished product in hand, the student's next challenge is how to market it to the local community. The Ag Business students come in and take that olive oil product that's been produced and get some hands-on experience in designing a label for that product that might make it appealing to consumers. They've been out at local industry events uh, promoting the product, actually doing tastings with consumers, talking about flavor profiles for olive oil, what a true extra virgin olive oil is. The response since we've started bottling has been uh, phenomenal. The community has just really been uh, very much uh, excited about the release of, of the oil. The project has met with rave reviews from students too, an example of the unique experiences available on this rural campus. It just meant the world to me because it's in my field of study and it's given me the chance to go and make sure this is something I want, but also it's given me an advantage over other people who've never had the experience of the hands-on learning, where we're so fortunate here that we could just walk outside from the classroom and we're here on the farm. I'm very fortunate to have one of the world's largest classrooms. Uh, I have a 300-acre classroom here at Reedley College, and that allows me the opportunity to get students outside of the classroom environment. The college is expanding the project with the planting of Tuscan olives to be harvested by future generations of students as they prepare for a life in agriculture whether on or off the farm. With the olive oil project, all these students really love and are influenced by this project and want to do well for the college and show off what we have here, so it's cool.